What's up guys, Stoner here from AudioEcstasyProductions.com and today I want to give you a really neat little tip on how to make your ASIO devices and drivers run with screencast software on Windows. Let's check it out. Alright, so ASIO drivers do not work with 99% of Windows screencasting software. It's just kind of one of the flaws of the design and there are workarounds and this is the easiest one that I have found and it works in any DAW. I'm in Reaper right now but I've tried it with Pro Tools and Studio One and to my knowledge it works with every DAW. It's a really simple fix. So what we have here is a sort of a mock master two bus strip and so we have just some basic processing that might be on a master bus we have some tape saturation and compression SSL bus compressor a, uh, a limiter and then the plugin that we're going to be talking about today that's Voxengo recorder it's a VST and what it does is it routes your audio to your native sound card on your computer so instead of the ASIO driver device being the last thing in the audio chain, it sends your signal to your native sound card. So it can play nice with the screencast software because there's almost a 100% chance that your native sound card will work with the screencast software, whichever screencast software you choose. All right, so it's pretty simple. Um, in the MME device uh, field, you just choose your native sound card. Mine is actually uh, speakers. Sound mapper is something else. Um, then you can sort of adjust the buffer size depending on your session. That's really going to be dependent on your system as well. So um, then you set the output file. You choose where you would like. Basically, it records a uh, two mix of your session to an output wave file. And then you, through there, you adjust where you'd like it to, to go. And you can also set the bit depth to whatever you're working with in your session. I'm at 32 float. Um, and then what you would do is you just hit start and then you would play your session and it records it to a two track WAV file. This is not the only fix for this problem, but it's the easiest one that I came across. And the plugin is free. Voxengo makes really, really good stuff. They have a frequency analyzer called Span that I love. Um, so give those guys some love. And hopefully this video can save somebody some time to sum up ASIO drivers do not work with 99% of screencast software on Windows. There are workarounds. Voxengo Recorder is one of them. This is Stoner with AudioEcstasyProductions.com. Cheers, guys.